Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here in Las Vegas and I'm so happy to be joined by former WC World Champion of the World, Sab Judah. How are you, Sab? I'm doing excellent, doing excellent. Good stuff. Well, huge fight here this weekend. I don't know if you've heard about it. Welder versus Fury. Just give me your thoughts on the fight itself. Um, the fight is going to be good. Um, I like Deontay Wilder in this fight. Only because um, his back is against the wall. You know what I'm saying? I, I know he's going to come here and show the world why he's the best pound for pound fighter today. I think that on that sense that you don't believe Fury when he says he's going to go out there and he's put, I think he's put maybe 15 pounds on from the, the last fight. I think you don't believe Fury when he says he's going to go in there and stop Wilder in two rounds. Gaining weight doesn't make you a knockout puncher. <laughs> so that doesn't, that, it doesn't, it doesn't go like that. Sounds good, looks good, but nah. So what, you're saying, are you going to think that Wilder's going to go in there and stop him early or is it going to be a late round stoppage? Early. Early? Can I get a prediction? Um, between one and three. I'll be a better now. I'll be a better now. The winner of this fight, obviously, he's a WBC world champion. Are you, as a fan of the sport as well, are you hoping that they go on to face and unify, become undisputed against somebody like Anthony Joshua? Are you hoping for that fight next? Um, of course. I think this is what the world wants. The world and everybody that's in boxing want to see Deontay Wilder and Anthony Joshua bang it out for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. I think we can see like what we've seen in the 80s with Hagler and Leonard and Duran and Hearns. That they, they, they fought each other, they lost, they went and on the rematch. You think we can see something similar with Joshua, Tyson? Well, we've seen the rematch with Wilder and a few, but are you hoping that we can see something that they can they all fight each other once or twice? I, w I, w I would love it. I would be, be at all three of them. Even in the UK? Even in the UK, <laughs> I'd be there. Yeah. We've seen PBC and Top Rank work together to get this fight made. Now there's a fight in your old weight class that every single fan, no matter whether in the UK, Europe, Africa, America want this fight to happen. It's Spence against Crawford. Because PBC have worked together and top rank for this fight, are you hoping that they can work together and get this Spence Crawford fight made? Um, I mean, you know, it's one step at a time. I mean, right right now they're establishing the business relationships. So that's a good thing. And you know, if this situation should go well, then maybe you'll see a, a Spence and uh Crawford fight down the line. Do you have a winner? Have you got someone in your head who you think will win that fight, Spence and Crawford? Nah, those are my two favorites right now, and um, I don't want to see them fight, but I know the world, they have to fight because that's the biggest fight of today. And, um, you know, I just hope that when they do fight, both fighters go in there healthy and come out healthy. Crawford, uh, Bob Adams came out and said that he would like to see Crawford against Conor McGregor. What's your thoughts on that? Crawford versus Conor McGregor. Yeah, it did. That's, that, that's easy work. <laughs> Boxing ring or MMA? Huh? In the ring or in the cage? No, no, no. If if he do MMA, no, no. I'm, I I got to go with Conor, you know what I'm saying? But uh, if he do boxing, yeah, I go with uh, 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 Bud all the way. So I won't keep you much longer. I know you've done tons of media, and I do thank you for taking some time out to speak to me. So enjoy the fights, champ. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, champ. Thank you.